Hi there. So today I'm going to be doing the weekly reading for the sign of Virgo. Not weekly reading. Sorry, guys. We're going to be doing a bonus reading for Virgo. Virgo. Um, your weekly reading had quite a few views, um, and I wanted to gift you guys a bonus reading um, for that. Um, if this video resonates with you, I'd really appreciate it if you like, comment, share, and subscribed. Um, and I do offer private readings. So if you're interested in that, the link, um, the information for that will be in the description box. Um, also, I will be extending this video. Um, so if you're interested in the extended reading, taking a deeper look at this situation, um, the link to the extended reading will be in the description box as well. All right, so let's take a look here. Bonus reading for my Virgos. What's going on with my Virgos? What do my Virgos need to know? There's been a lot of um, coming karmic situations closing out, karmic cycles closing out, um, and a lot of the bonus readings that I've been doing. So let's see if the same thing rings true for your reading, okay? Or what's going on with you guys. All right, eight cards for Virgo. We have Page of Swords. So you guys can be getting some type of information or some type of clarity. Um, this could be somebody wanting to communicate with you, and this could also be somebody um, spying on you, okay? Watching you, keeping tabs on you. Could be dealing with a water sign, okay? Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Three of Pentacles. Um, you may be getting... Somebody, someone may want to collaborate with you. Two of Cups. Someone may want to come together with you for a, um, a union here. Or let's see here. Ace of Cups and have a new beginning in love. And you're gaining this information. Or you may be gaining information. Mm, you guys may be gaining information that your person is having is collaborating with someone else um, and starting a new beginning in love elsewhere, and you're gaining this type of inf this gaining this information because we have the five of pentacles here. Someone's getting left out in the cold here. Death. Yeah, there's an ending here. Somebody's getting left out in the cold. Two of pentacles because somebody was had two options somebody was juggling judgment somebody made a decision and i feel like someone's being walked away from here someone is being left out in the cold i feel like it's you guys honestly i'm sorry it's like you guys are finding out that your person has emotions that they've been putting emotion into another situation or that they want to collaborate with someone and have a union and they're they're pursuing a new beginning in love and somebody's getting left out in the cold here and it's causing an ending to a situation because of juggling someone's made a decision though they're not juggling anymore all right let's get some clarifiers all right what's the page of swords What's this information or this spying or... Okay, that's a lot of cards. <laughs> Let me um, reshuffle that. All right. Page of Swords. This is Page of Swords energy spirit. The lovers. Yeah, something's being found out about a love connection here. What about the love connection? Someone's um, very close to giving up or someone's tired, grown tired of a situation, grown. Um, there's a cycle very close to ending out in a love connection here. And someone is gaining this information. What's the King of Cups? Yeah, the King of Cups is offering an apology, apologizing to someone, offering their love here. It's causing someone a lot of stress and anxiety and sleepless nights. It could be them being scared to offer or apologize, offer love here. Give me one more card on the Page of Swords and the Nine of Wands, the Lovers. Yeah, it's like you're finding out that this person is giving to something else, all right, to a love connection. And that um, there's, gonna, there's about to be a cycle and it's making you guys grow tired of the situation. You guys are very close to closing out this cycle with this person because this person is giving to somebody else. I'm telling you guys. Um, what's this nine of swords? The chariot. Someone's moving away from fear and they're bringing forth an offer here. Someone may have been scared to bring forth this king of cups. 
Yeah, they're working on a new passionate beginning here. What does this mean for Virgo? Yeah, you guys are finding out that they're working on a new passionate beginning. Two of Cups. Oops. Yeah. You guys are gaining clarity about this and it's causing a, a painful ending here. Or you guys are setting some type of boundary with this person because you're finding out that they're giving to somebody else. And it's causing an ending here to a cycle. It's been a painful cycle, but it's coming to an end. This is Ace of Cups. Seven of Pentacles. So yeah, somebody's investing in a new beginning in love here. What does this mean for Virgo? This could be, you guys could be dealing with a fire sign, an Aries Leo Sag. Um, but this is just someone taking action um, to invest in a new beginning in love here. Something that they feel passionate about. Yeah, somebody's moving away from something so that they can invest in a new beginning in love here. Five of Pentacles. What's this mean for Virgo? A decision is being made here to abandon a situation because somebody feels like they're being left out in the cold and heal. Tell me more about the Five of Pentacles. Yeah, there's some type of decision being made here to abandon the situation, to leave something behind. Somebody could not see clearly before, but now they do see clearly. What's the death card? Manifesting. Somebody is ending something to manifest something else. They could be waiting on something as well. Five of, yeah. Somebody is manifesting something else and it's leaving somebody else out in the cold, okay? Leaving somebody feeling abandoned. All right, that's a lot of cards. But yeah, see, this is exactly... King of Cups. The King of Cups is coming out again. That's that water energy, okay? They're choosing a new direction. And it's causing a conflict, all right? What's the Two of Pentacles? Yeah, somebody was holding back for making a decision here. But a decision has been made now. Because they needed to gain enlightenment. They needed to gain perspective about the situation. Um... Someone's going to be feeling, someone is feeling disappointed or someone is feeling regret about a decision that they made. What's this five of cups? They regret not putting the effort into something or they feel, or somebody is sad because someone is not putting the effort into a situation with them. What's this decision or this judgment? Yeah. The decision is to end to something here. There's an ending. So your person is deciding to end this cycle with you to yes exactly they're ending something with you to have a new passionate beginning or to communicate with someone else about a reconciliation here about healing a situation yeah reconciliation third party energy there's a third party that this person is trying to heal things with all right guys i'm sorry that this was the reading that came through for you guys but this is again is another karmic cycle ending okay and that can only mean good things for you guys i know that it doesn't seem it's not that great of a message that you're the person that you were involved with is you know wanting to end the cycle with you to pursue someone else but the thing is is that this person can no longer hurt you this pain the cycle the cycle that you've been going through with them is done they can not hurt you anymore they cannot backstab you anymore they cannot catch you off guard anymore that's done um and now you guys can manifest something better for your future so that's the bright side of this situation um but yeah this is just another reading about a karmic cycle closing out okay guys so if you're interested in the um extended reading the link will be in the description box um but if not thank you so much for watching and i'll talk to you guys soon bye